Welcome everyone. In today's video, I am going to share a solution for an important problem. I know that this is a big need and that's why I am there for you to build confidence and comfort in solving. So let's get started to solve this problem. So we have to form a partial differential equation by eliminating the arbitrary functions. So we have to eliminate this function f of x and g of x from the equation z is equal to y into f of x plus s in x into g of y. Here is the solution. Here in this, what is the equation given? Z is equal to y into f of x plus x into g of y. First of all, as usual, we have to differentiate with respect to x. If we differentiate with respect to x, see what will happen. So, if we differentiate with respect to x, so we have to treat y as a constant. So, then it will be dou z by dou x is equal to y. It will be a constant. For f of x, it will be f dash of x. And again, for x, it is 1. And this is g of y. So, as you all know that dou z by dou x can be written as p. So, in place of dou z by dou x, if I write p here, then it will be p is equal to y into f dash of x plus g of y. I am taking the value of uh, f dash of x from here. Then it will be p minus g of y is equal to y times of f dash of x. Therefore, f dash of x is equal to, see here, p minus g of y by y. So, if I differentiate with respect to x, I got this equation that is f dash of x. I am keeping it as equation 2 and this is equation 1. So, again we have from equation 1, z is equal to y into f of x plus x into g of y. What I have to do now? I have to differentiate with respect to y this time. Differentiate with respect to y. If I differentiate with respect to y, it will become dou z by dou y is equal to for y it is 1. This is f of x plus x it is a constant. We have to write as it is and this will be g dash of y. As you all know that we have to write, we can write dou z by dou y as q. If I write this, then it will be q is equal to f of x plus x into g dash of y. Then see here. Q minus f of x will be x times of g dash of x. If I want this g dash of x value, then what will happen? Then g dash of x, sorry this is y, g dash of y is equal to q minus f of x by x. So, this is the value of g dash of y after differentiating with respect to y. See here our question is z is equal to y into f f of x plus x into g of y. If I differentiate with respect to x, I got the value. If I calculated, I got the value of f dash of x and after that if I differentiate with respect to y, I got g dash of y. See what I have to do. These two equations are not sufficient for removing, for eliminating the functions so i'll make another one that is if i make dou square z by dou x dou y see this value is s actually so this will be dou by dou x of this is dou z by dou y so what is our dou z by dou y value so here it is dou z by dou y value which is nothing but see here i'm writing this is f of x plus x times of g dash of y. This equation I have to differentiate with respect to x. See here with respect to x it will be f dash of x. For x it is 1. So 1 into g dash of y. So which is nothing but dou square z by dou x dou y I got. So we have dou square z by dou x dou y we can write as s. As I said to you earlier that we can write as s. So we got the value of s as f dash of x plus g dash of y. So this if I consider as equation 3. So substitute. Now what I will do? Substitute the values of f dash of x g dash of y from equation 2 and 3. 
so this is equation 2 and this this will be 4 so equation 2 and 3 in equation 4 see here c or s will be f dash of x plus g dash of y from equation 2 what is our f dash of x value f dash of x value is nothing but p minus g of y by y see here and after differentiating with respect to y i got g dash of y value as so here g dash of y value is nothing but i am substituting here which is nothing but q minus f of x by x so i got from equation 2 f dash of x value and uh, g dash of y value also from this equation 3 after substituting i can take x y as lcm so this will be x into p minus g of y plus if i take a y as an x y as lcm then it will be y times of q minus f of x so if i send this x y to that side then s x y is equal to this will be p x minus x into g of y plus y into q minus y into f of x see here s x y if i write p x plus q y if i take minus common then it will be x into g of y plus y into f of x see from the question here from the question here what is x into g of y plus y into f of x it is z so since from 1 z is equal to see here y into f of x plus x into g of y so this is equation 1 this is equation 1 if i substitute then it will be yes x y is equal to p x minus q y minus z so this is the final answer and there is no functions here so we have eliminated the functions so which functions we have eliminated f of x and g of y so this is the final answer if you see once it's so simple so the question is given as z is equal to y into f of x plus x into g of y we have to differentiate with respect to x and after differentiating and solving i got f dash of x value and after differentiating with respect to y i got g dash of uh, y value so we have two functions here to eliminate and these two um, questions uh, the, these two equations are not, are not sufficient so see here so dou square z by dou x dou y after making so i got this equation that is s is equal to f dash of x plus g dash of x from equation 2 and equation 3 I have substituted these values and after taking lcm i got the final answer as s x y is equal to p x minus q y minus z so this is how we have to solve to eliminate the arbitrary functions so here is an another problem so this one if you can solve this form the partial differential equation by eliminating the arbitrary functions again we have to eliminate the arbitrary functions from the equation x y plus y z plus z x is equal to f of z by x plus y so here is the solution so x y plus y z plus z x is equal to f of z plus x plus y so we have to solve this how we can solve this so for, for solving this First, we have to differentiate with respect to x as usual. So, differentiate with respect to x. If I differentiate with respect to x, see here, for x it is 1, y I am leaving. Next, y I have to leave. In z, there are two independent variables. So, dou z by dou x, I have to differentiate with respect to x. And so, I have to make a uv rule here. This is u and this is v. So, for that, x is 1 z i have to leave x i have to leave and for z it is dou z by dou x so this is see here this is f dash of z by x plus y and again i have to make a uv rule that is v square this is v for one time and i have to differentiate u minus z times of for x is 1 so, I can write as you all know that 
do z by do x i can represent as p so i am writing as y plus y p plus z plus x p is equal to f dash of z by x plus y is equal to x plus y into p minus z by x plus y whole square so here if i write properly this is z plus y times if i take this p as common then x plus y into p if i take p p as common from these two terms then see it will be p is equal to f dash of z by x plus y into x plus y p minus z by x plus y whole square is it clear so if i can take this value see what i'll do then f dash z by x plus y value will be so this part it will go to that side that is z plus y plus x plus y into p if i if it's dividing this side it will multiply that side that is x plus y whole square by x plus y into p minus z so f dash of z value is ready after differentiating with respect to x so we have again x y plus y z plus z x value so this is equation one now we have to differentiate with respect to y this time so differentiate with respect to y so what will happen x will be a constant and for y it is 1 that is 1 into x plus see here uv rule for y it is 1 z is left over y i have to leave for z it is dou z by dou y plus x times of for z it is dou z by dou y it will be f dash of z by x plus y so this is x plus y whole square this is x plus y and this is dou z by dou y z i have to leave for y it is 1 so this is a uv rule so again we have to write dou z by dou y we can write dou z by dou y as q here so if i replace dou z by dou y as q then it will be x plus z plus y q plus x q is equal to f dash of z by x plus y see here it is x plus y into q minus z by x plus y whole square if i take common that is x plus z if i take uh, q common from this q common from this two then it will be x plus y times of q is equal to f dash of z by x plus y into again x plus y into q minus z by x plus y whole square if i can take this value then it will be f dash of z by x plus y is equal to so see here this is see here x plus z plus x plus y into q if i send this it will multiply that is x plus y whole square divided by x plus y into q minus z so this is the final answer so this is square and after differentiating with respect to y i got this value so see here so this i can write as equation 3 so this value after differentiating with respect to x i can write as 2 so to eliminate the constants what i have to do do now to eliminate the constants i have to equate these two so these two values are equal if you observe equation 2 and equation 3 values is f dash of z by x plus 1 here also it is f dash of z by x plus 1 1 so to eliminate the constant so i have to equate so equation 2 is equal to equation 3 what is equation 2 so see here i am noting that is z plus y plus x plus y into p into see here that is x plus y whole square by 
x plus y into p minus z. So here in this equation if you see then it will be x plus z plus x plus y into q into x plus y whole square by see here it is x plus y into q minus z. So I have to solve this. So here there are no functions here. So I have to eliminate the functions. I can cancel this one. This is the only term. So if I cross multiply then my problem is finished. That is x plus y plus x plus y into p into if I bring this to other side then it will be x plus y q minus z which is equal to here what is left over x plus z plus x plus y into q if I multiply this one it will multiply that it will be x plus y into p minus z so this is the final answer so you can multiply and you can take uh, p and q as common if needed so this is how we have to solve this is also so simple see here first of all this is equation one i have differentiated with respect to x and i have taken this value of dash of z by x plus y and again i have differentiated with respect to y and again f dash of z plus y value so these values if i equate i can eliminate i can eliminate the functions given functions this is how we have to solve uh, the, elimina the eliminations of functions first we have to differentiate with respect to x and then with respect to y mm, if not sufficient you can go further and you can differentiate to solve the problem so i hope that you will come to take a look at my next video in which i want to share many solutions for the most important problems so keep watching stay tuned and uh, if you like my video please raise the thumb and subscribe to my channel, share it to your friends and leave a comment below and have a nice day.